Initial attacks have gone off without a hitch. The Tyrannus is on her last leg. Delta and Epsilon wings have destroyed most of the Tyrannus' fighter escort. It is time to finish the job. To this end, Terran Command has sent a full wing of Athena bombers, equipped with a newly developed stiletto bomb. The Athena is our most maneuverable bomber. It carries a massive payload, yet in dogfights, is nearly as effective as a fighter. The Stiletto bomb has now been thoroughly tested back in Seoul and is now ready for use. It can be used to destroy subsystems on any ship and should prove more effective than the disruptor cannon. The electronic seeking device should make it simple to use. Just point and shoot. The Leto homing capabilities are limited, so make sure you get a clean shot before you launch. The Stiletto should be especially useful in destroying the Tyrannus' engines and weapon systems. All Athena bombers will be equipped with Stilettos and will be piloted by Alpha Wing. The Kane-class cruiser Tyrannus has been chased from the Beta Cygni system back to the IKEA system. It is low on supplies, and due to recent engagements, it is lightly guarded. Long-range sensors indicate that only two fighters and three bombers remain to protect the Tyrannus. Tyrannus is heading for the Beta Cygni subspace node, where it will probably resupply. This will allow for a small window of opportunity in which to conduct a strike. Your primary objective is to disable and disarm the Tyrannus in order to enable its capture. This will be our first attempt to capture a major Shivan vessel. Three wings will be assigned to this task. Alpha Wing will be flying Athena bombers. These bombers just arrived on the Galate and are equipped with a new Stiletto bomb. The Stiletto is capable of destroying subsystems in one hit. Alpha's primary responsibility will be to disarm and disable the Tyrannus. Beta Wing is assigned to escort Alpha and protect it from fighter attacks. Beta will fly Apollo-class fighters. Gamma Wing will fly Valkyries and should engage any hostile fighters and bombers in the area. If needed elsewhere, they can be assigned to any task that you see fit. Once the Tyrannus has been disarmed and disabled, Omega Transports will arrive and capture it. When the Tyrannus has been captured, you are to return to the Galate for debriefing. Do not allow the Tyrannus to escape or be destroyed. Good luck. Disabling target.